Red witchweed, also known as Striga asiatica, is a parasitic plant that could pose a risk to Queensland's agricultural industries. Hosts of red witchweed include economically important grasses and summer cereals such as sorghum, corn or maize, rice and sugarcane. Unlike most weeds that compete with crops, red witchweed damages plants more directly by tapping into the host plant's root system and taking its nutrients and water. The host plant then wastes energy supporting red witchweed growth rather than its own. Red witchweed grows between 10 and 40 centimetres tall. Its leaves are arranged in opposite pairs along the stem. Leaves are 6 to 40 millimetres long and 1 to 4 millimetres wide and have a tapered, pointed tip. Its flowers are 5 to 20 millimetres in diameter and are usually red. However, white, yellow or pink flowers have been found overseas. Red witchweed reproduces from seeds. The seeds are tiny and dust-like and can easily drop into the soil, enabling its spread. A single plant can produce between 25,000 and 200,000 seeds. The minute seeds are mainly dispersed by wind, water, soil movement or human activities. When a vehicle or machine is driven through a weed-infested area, seeds can become lodged and carried considerable distances before dislodging in new areas. Red witchweed can survive and produce seeds in a wide range of soils, but generally prefers free-draining sandy or gravelly soils. The most likely place to find red witchweed in a commercial crop is in these soil types. You should observe a property hygiene protocol and avoid moving equipment and other things that might carry soil if not appropriately washed down. Adequate wash down of machinery and equipment and other biosecurity precautions can reduce the risk of spreading red witchweed. Red witchweed is a notifiable pest plant in Queensland. If you find it on your property, you must report it to Biosecurity Queensland immediately on 13 25 23. Remember, early detection and control is vital to protect our agricultural industries.